the traditional surgical method for treating GERD is the Nissen fundoplication. When we do anti-reflux surgery, we always repair a hiatal hernia if that is there. Now, simply repairing the hernia does not repair the lower esophageal sphincter, does not give a high pressure zone there to help prevent uh, acid from the stomach refluxing up into the esophagus. So we need to add to the hiatal hernia some type of an anti-reflux procedure itself. And traditionally, it's been the Nissen fundoplication where we take the fundus of the stomach and wrap it all the way around the lower part of the esophagus. So if the higher pressure of the stomach is transmitted to that lower portion of the esophagus. It's a very effective procedure. It's very easy to do and can be done laparoscopically, usually in about an hour or less with a one-day hospital stay. Very small incisions and very rapid recovery. One of the things that we've found is that when we do successful reflux surgery, patients will wake up in the recovery room and say, you know, immediately they can tell they're not refluxing. The Nissen fundoplication got a bad name back in the early late 50s and early 60s because surgeons tended to make a wide, tight fundoplication. And I think human nature is, is that if you're trying to prevent something from refluxing, you just try to wrap that stomach around to get it nice and tight. And what we found is if we did that, people would have what's called gas bloat where they could not uh, they couldn't belch. They might have a hard time vomiting. They were very uncomfortable. And so we have learned through the years that what we need to do is to make what's called a, a very narrow, uh, about an inch or less than an inch fundoplication or only wrap a very narrow amount of the fundus around the esophagus. And we also want to make it loose. We call it a floppiness and where we purposely make it loose. We're not trying to strangle the esophagus. We're just trying to give that added pressure to it so that uh, that pressure zone will prevent reflux. Again, that's been our traditional surgical method. We have some new things that we also do, but the Nissen fundoplication is still a very good procedure, very effective, and uh, very simple to do in the hands of uh, advanced minimally invasive surgical uh, specialists.